The Playhouse is about to take Cincinnati on a ride. August Wilson's Jitney takes you inside an unlicensed car service in the 1970s in Pittsburgh. Joining me this morning are director Timothy Douglas and actor Michael Anthony Williams. Thanks for coming in this morning, Thanks guys. For Thanks for us. having Tell us. Tell us a little bit more about the play. Uh, Jitney is written by August Wilson, the late great African-American writer who took upon himself to chronicle black American life. Mm -hmm. In the 20th century, wrote one play for each decade of the 20th century called The American Century Cycle. Jitney's is his 1970s play, mm -hmm. and it's a look at the lives of black men and women striving to survive in a very challenging time in mm -hmm. Pittsburgh. But it's really the story about the people. Mm -hmm. uh, Jitney's are unlicensed cabs. You know, before there was Uber, mm -hmm. there were places like the Jitney station where you could call in and order up a taxi to take you wherever you needed to go in the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. And so feature, that's what's kind of focused around the stories around, it sounds like. Correct. And a lot of strong characters, and you play one of them, it sounds like? Yes, I play a character named Dub, and all of the characters in this in this play have their own story to tell. Mm -hmm. And uh, that those stories, along with the collective story that, that he's put together, is magical. And what do you most like about the character you play? Uh, I think the, the thing about this character is that he's very grounded. And he reminds me a lot of some of the older men that I grew up here with in Cincinnati. Yeah, and welcome home for this play. Yes, it's great it's to be home. Fantastic to have you back. Yes, <laughs> yes. And tell us a little bit about how this play, although set in the 1970s, maybe is very relevant to today's time, as you were noting. Um, for all actors, artists, the work is always personal, but to be in a room with such powerful, potent black men and humans that have regular day-to-day -day challenges, but specifically the face of black men, the face of black America, given the times and the daily headlines uh, we live in, and particularly uh, two killings that happen while we're in rehearsal, that we, you know, we look at each other every day at rehearsal and see so deep into the soul, and as a result, the work is mined from that depth. So at that soul level, it is absolutely a universal uh, American human story, but on the face, it is specifically about the lives of these black men and women. Mm. And Michael, were you particularly drawn to this play to be a, a big role in it? Or well, to any, time, any chance I get to play August Wilson, I, I want to play it. Mm. And uh, the opportunity to come home and do yeah. that was just an extra added bonus. And Timothy and I have worked together before, and any chance I get to work with <laughs> Timothy on <laughs> Sounds like a win for everybody. Yes. So there, there is such a thing as an August Wilson actor. He requires a very kind, mm. particular muscle, and Michael is absolutely one of them. And this is our third August Wilson yes. play oh, together. Great. Yes. great. Well, looking forward to seeing it. Sounds like a great play. Glad you guys brought it to Cincinnati to show us. August Wilson's Jitney will be at the Playhouse's Mark's Theater. It opens today. It runs through November 12th. Tickets start at $35. Just call the box office at 513-421-3888. Timothy and Michael, thanks so much. Thank you.